Right. I want to ask you about Hunter Biden because you write about this in some level of detail in the book. Joe Biden, when he was a candidate, Jen Psaki, both dismissed this as it's just Russian disinformation. Now, none other than the New York Times has confirmed. Yes, indeed, there was a laptop that was dropped off at a shop in Delaware, and yes, indeed, it had emails on it that are now being investigated by the Department of Justice. You say that you yelled at President Trump when he asked you about it. You said, Mr. President, I can't talk about that. I am not going to. Trump protested, you know, if that was one of my kids, and you said, damn it, Mr. President, I'm not going to talk to you about Hunter Biden, period. You are no longer in office, so let's get you to talk about it. Where do you think this is headed? Well, I, you know, I, I'm limited in what I can say because I don't want to discuss any possible ongoing investigations, but my reaction to the president there was obviously uh, resisting the idea of injecting uh, a criminal investigation of one of the candidate's children into the race uh, when when there hasn't been any definitive judgment over at the Department of Justice. So I made it clear uh, I wasn't going to discuss criminal cases with him, especially mm -hmm. ones that he might have an interest in. Uh, so I would, I would still do that today. But I was very disturbed during the debate when, when uh, candidate Biden lied to the American people about the laptop. He squarely confronted with the laptop and he suggested that it was Russian disinformation and pointed to the letter written by some intelligence people that was baseless, uh, which he knew was, was a lie. And uh, I, was, I was shocked by that. And fortunately, the DNI came out and said, no, it's, it's, it's not disinformation. The FBI said the same thing. The media ignored it. Uh, so when you're talking about interference in an election, I, I can't think of anything more uh, than that no, kind no, of... Knowing what you know of the case, do you think that there is any legal liability for the president here? Perhaps not I, while he's I, in I, office. I wouldn't want to venture an opinion on that. Let me ask it a different way, Bill. So you, obviously there was the media coverage of this, which obviously is being highlighted, um, was all over the place and atrocious. And, and, and now there's the New York Post, for example, the headline right now is the White House ignores its Hunter problem. Suddenly Jen Psaki can't comment on something that she commented on many, many, many times before. Uh, so does the White House have a problem here? Well, I think now that, you know, from a political standpoint, now that this is uh, in people's consciousness, it had been suppressed up till now, obviously they, they have a hot potato, and just to see how they handle it will be interesting.